Stephen, getting to be part of the Dodgers broadcast team as play-by-play, -play, returning home, having grown up in Orange County. What does this job mean to you? It's a lot. It's, it's been a lot to take in. It really has been because it's. This isn't just any organization. You know, there are pro teams, and then there are others that are cut above, and the Dodgers are certainly that. So that's one factor. Being back around the people that care about the most, my family and our friends, that's a factor. So uh, I've said this is the, the honor of my career. I, I really do mean that. It's not blowing smoke um, to try and pander to the Dodger crowd. This is um, this mean this opportunity means a lot and trying every day to make sure I earn it. Hello from inside the booth at Dodger Stadium next to the Bulldog Oral Hershiser. I'm Stephen Nelson. To own the distinction of being the only Asian American play-by-play -play in Major League Baseball, what, what does that mean to you? It's a couple of things. One, it's uh, a distinction that I, I cherish, but I also know the responsibility that that carries. And so uh, that's that's at the forefront of my mind, yeah. you know, as I embark on this new chapter in my career, because um, I, I want to do well for myself and my family, sure, but I know that it's it's not just about me. Um, uh, Dave Sims of the Seattle Mariners told me, you open the door, now you hold it open, because there are hopefully others behind you. And so, um, that's why I, I'd say, I wouldn't say putting, that's why I'm, I wouldn't say I'm putting pressure on myself, but it's definitely something that I'm carrying, um, and carrying with pride, to be sure, but it's, I didn't think I'd ever, <laughs> that's, that's not something I was ever, I'm ready for. You know, I'm sorry for, I don't really have the words. Nihon no media no, mina sama, konbanwa, MLB Network no Nelson Etsuo to mo shimasu. You've been able to speak Japanese and you use that in words. Skosh. Skosh. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. <laughs> but, but you made it a point to introduce Shohei Otani in Japanese, and I know you tried to speak some when you were back in Japan. What has that process been like, and why is it important to you to, to speak in Japanese? Uh, again, it was. I think it's just trying to stay connected with that part of my life. You know, I, when I was a kid, um, four or five, I was really young. I went to Japanese school, J school here in the Southland, and you know, and then cut to high school. My high school offered Japanese. It's like, yep, I'm I'm back in it again. And um, I was the only one in my household who spoke it, so I've never been able to really apply it. So it's very broken. You know, it's just that like kid school brain where you study to study as opposed to study to learn sometimes. And um, doing the games in Japan. It's, yeah, it's just sort of inspiring. It's like, you know what, I'm, I want to try and get back on that horse a little bit and pick up more and retain it now um, as I get older. Japanese fans are so devoted to the game of baseball, too. I'm sure they love that he makes the connection that he does. Yeah, representation. I'm sure his family is so yeah. proud, too.